Large parts of the Netherlands lie below sea level. Dry feet are not something the Dutch take for granted. World-famous projects, such as the Delta Project, are proof of our successful battle against the sea. For centuries now, dunes and beaches have been providing the main protection against the sea. Dunes which, along with the beach, have grown through a combined action of sand, wind and water. The Dutch coast never stops moving. Without intervention, the coast slowly moves inland under natural influences. Rijkswaterstaat, the executive body of the Dutch Ministry of Infrastructure and the Environment, is responsible for protecting us against the sea. Why use sand? Sand is a relatively inexpensive solution, and it fits in nicely with the natural character of the coast. It's a flexible material, which is easy to apply. It's also a sustainable solution, which can be easily adjusted to future developments. The basic principle is to keep the coastline where it is. We've been doing this since 1990. Each year we check if there's enough sand on the beaches and on the seabed, off the coastline. If there's not enough sand, we supplement it taking rising sea levels into account. The sand is added in various places on or off the coast by means of dredges. Rijkswaterstaat prefers to add sand in the sea right off the coast. The sand is subsequently dumped straight from the ship's hold onto the seabed. Or blasted from the ship by means of the so-called rainbowing process. This creates a sandbank that acts as a breakwater the currents move the sand slowly towards the beach. If it's not possible to deposit the sand on the seabed off the coast, it's deposited straight on the beach. This usually involves a mixture of sand and water that's blasted onto the beach from a dredger via pipes. Bulldozers then distribute the sand. Sometimes there are natural deep channels off the coast that slowly move towards the coast. In order to prevent the coast from weakening, this channel is partially filled with sand. This makes the channel move seawards again. International dredging companies carry out these projects under direction of Rijkswaterstaat. They also look to reduce CO2 emissions. The sand we use for coastal maintenance comes from the North Sea, about 10 kilometers from the coast. That's a safe place to remove sand, after which it's reintroduced just below the coast. In some cases, we create work through work. In other words, when we widen or deepen navigation channels, we remove sand from those sites and reintroduce it right off the coast. We're talking 12 million cubic meters of sand on an annual basis, which we reintroduce along the entire Dutch coast. That's about eight football stadiums full of sand. When we deposit sand on the beach, we have to take local requirements into account, and we always contact the local councils to find out what the best season is to do this. We want to reduce any inconvenience to those enjoying the beach to a minimum. We won't work on the beach in July and August, for instance. The most important reason for this work must be the safety for the whole of the Netherlands. An added bonus is the beautiful wide beaches. When you work with nature, you have to make careful considerations. In coastal maintenance, protecting the country against the sea takes priority. Rijkswaterstaat keeps a close eye on the effects it has on nature and the environment. In the case of sand excavation, we extensively document the environmental effects. They have a major impact on the decision-making process. With coastal management in general, we study the effects on nature in collaboration with nature organizations. We continuously look at how we can improve coastal maintenance, how we can do it smarter at the lowest possible cost. We also try and take opportunities relating to nature and recreation. Furthermore, we study the possibilities and methods to use the forces of nature even better for coastal maintenance. One example is the Zandmotor. The Zandmotor, sand motor, is an artificial peninsula off the coast of the province of Zuid-Holland. 
Rijkswaterstaat and a number of knowledge institutions are studying the possibility of nature distributing the sand along the coast if a large amount of sand is added in one go. If the trial with the Zand motor works, the coast will need a lot less maintenance in that location. Sand has proven itself as the perfect solution to keep the coast safe. By adding more sand, the coast can grow in proportion to the anticipated rise in sea levels. This will keep the Netherlands dry, now and in the future. Sand, wind, water and Rijkswaterstaat. Naturally safe.